Hello dear friends, Chef to yourself is again with you. I'm Jim Davis and my co-creator and the spirit of the whole project Svetlana Davis is behind the camera. Hello! Well, while Thanksgiving is approaching, we're all thinking about family tables and of course the queen of this table would be turkey. However, not everybody can get together with the family especially nowadays with this uh, COVID pandemic situation. Some people will have to be alone or just two of you. But it doesn't mean that you can have a holiday spirit, i.e. turkey on your table. And today we'll show you hassle-free, easy way to have turkey just for one or two. The name of this dish is turkey wings in spicy gravy. This dish derives from Armenia. It, was, it, it is a very popular dish during the win, winter time. So what we have here, we've got four turkey wings. I cut off the tip of the wings and we'll use it probably to make some consomme. So <clears throat> I'm cooking for uh, four persons. So apparently two wings per person. Then for marinade, because we're going to marinate this, I've got some spices. So, I've got <clears throat> cayenne pepper, turmeric, garlic powder, marjoram, basil, <coughs> some cumin, bay leaf, I broke it, and sweet paprika, pressed garlic, olive oil, white wine vinegar. That's it guys, and some stuff here, that's some um, flour and some mustard, well, and that's for making a gravy. So let's start. First of all we need to mix up all the um, spices and then marinate our wings, mixing our spices. Pepper, turmeric, garlic powder. I think with this dish you spend more time preparing the spices exactly. than cooking it. Exactly, garlic. Measure. Basil. Cumin. Bay leaf. Finally, paprika. And now let's mix it all together. And now we will add first vinegar and mix it again and olive oil. Okay, our marinade is ready. Plastic bag for one gallon. We'll put our turkey inside this bag. Okay. And then we'll pour our marinade inside. Now, we almost forgot about a very important ingredient, salt. So I believe for this particular uh, quantity of uh, turkey wings, I will put uh, two teaspoons of salt. So our marinade is ready. Let's zip it down, get rid of the air inside, and now just let's rub it. toss it and rub it together. Okay, friends, my friends, our night is ready. We're gonna leave it this way. We're gonna leave it this way for probably half an hour, 45 minutes. Well, I think that uh, our wings marinated enough. And now let's put them into the baking dish. Okay, one. And if you notice, we put this 
on the grid because I hope to have enough juice to make a gravy. Okay. Now we use the baking dish. Now we'll put it into the oven for an hour, an hour and a half. It depends on the size of your wings. So guys, you should just watch over them uh, very attentively. When they're ready, usually it takes from one to one and a half hour at the temperature 360 degrees. Well guys, that's been an hour and let's check on our wings. Wow, look at this beauty. Looks like they're ready. Let's Let, try. Let's try. A couple of this one as well. Okay. Let's put it aside. Right here. Look. Wow. They're fully cooked. And look how juicy they are. Let's look at this one. Look, take a look at this one. Same look. It's juicy. Juice just running out. And very tender it seems. And very tender. I believe they are ready. So the next stage, let's put them aside and we'll prepare gravy. Guys, I strained the juice in my little pot and now we're preparing the gravy. Here's one teaspoon of flour and two teaspoons of water. And we're putting it here. Then we're adding one tablespoon of yellow mustard. Now I'm gonna cook this gravy on the low on the low heat. Uh, it probably is gonna be ready in no time. Well, guys, our gravy is ready. It was too thick and concentrated, so I just had to add uh, just a quarter uh, cup of water. And look at this. That's just then our little jack. Here we go. Okay. That's stainy. <laughs> Never mind. Okay. Dear friends, we believe that's a perfect, perfect dish for a Thanksgiving table. And our traditional pairing. My, I strongly believe that the best pairing for this particular dish with a good, good California Chardonnay. Dear friends, thank you for being with us. We really, really value your company comments and everything. And at the end, we just want to wish you very, very healthy and happy holiday seasons. Goodbye. See you soon.